how bad it's after the space team. Um, I'm just really proud of the team for playing pretty consistently. We had a little blip at the end of the third set, but um, there were moments where we were starting to lose momentum, but we just played steady. We trusted that we had the ability um, and that they had each other and they just kind of stayed calm and eventually came, um, the points came and, and uh, again, other than that little blip in the third set, but then they recovered. So I guess I'm just really proud with the stability that they played throughout the match. And coming in a, not necessarily the longest team, not the longest trip to take for, uh, for you all, and you played a game in this gym earlier this season. Did that provide uh, a certain level of comfort uh, coming into tonight's game? Yeah, um, I think we tried to focus on getting used to the gym because a lot of us, I'd say we get like nervous being in here, like bright lights, and we focused on getting used to like be it like the depth perception and all that. So that was one of our main focuses coming in. Uh, yeah, no, um, we did have a couple practices before the game, which definitely helped. And one of our main focuses was to just get used to the spacing in this gym because our gym at home is like a little bit more enclosed. So um, just getting used to that space. I wouldn't say that this is necessarily a comfortable gym for us, which is what makes me extra proud to get the win tonight because we've had some really difficult matches in this gym in the past and just overcoming that obstacle to take the win was just like a really big deal for us. But we were excited for the location because we have two girls from Williamsburg and girls from Chesapeake and I went to William & Mary so a lot of us are very comfortable and know this area. So, And then of course our assistant coach being a CNU alum <laughs> so it was nice to be uh, back at least in an area that we know. So speaking a little bit more about the game, in the third set, it looked like you guys were in line for the sweep, and then to drop the third set, but come back and win it in four, that's never an easy thing to do. What does that say about your team in total and your team's mentality going into the game? Grit. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, one of our themes for this season is grit, and I think we showed a lot of it out there this uh, tonight. It was really exciting. Huh? Yeah. <laughs> that summed it up. <laughs> so you guys had 14 aces this evening. Really? <laughs> I remember when she had two that were in a key spot. Those I remember. Can you guys talk a bit about that? Is that something you focus on in practice? Um, I think our focus like tonight was serving tough. Serving how we serve every game. Even though we forgot to warm up serving because I messed up the time. <laughs> so I'm glad to hear that we got 14 aces. But um, yeah, we are a really strong serving team. That's something that we definitely focus on in practice. Mm -hmm. And um, that not only makes us better servers in the game, but it also makes us better serve receivers because we have to serve each other's, I mean, pass each other's serves. Mm -hmm. So um, yeah, that's definitely a big focus for us. Uh, we have one middle that especially, like we call her, we say she has a stinky serve. <laughs> <laughs> and um, yeah, she creates a lot of points for us. Her name is Maya. And um, yeah, but like honestly, everyone always brings out their A game when they get back there because they know that that's the one thing that they can control in the game. <laughs> <laughs> last question here for you is anyone's answer is just what is the experience like to, to be able to play in the NCAA tournament? Play a team? Oh, playing in the Yeah. Well, that was a big deal for us because um, now we've made it farther than we ever have um, in this tournament. Last year was our first NCAA appearance ever in the, his the history of the program, right? And so now coming back again this year and being able to like even make it farther is just a big deal. Um, I know that was a goal for me as a senior, as a graduating senior. I definitely wanted to make at least make it farther than we did last year so that we can just keep getting better every year and creating this legacy that like this is the expectation, you know? <laughs> yeah, I mean, I've been at Marymount for a long time. So this is my 27th season and I couldn't be happier and I'm just so happy, you know, to have that NCAA experience last year and then to repeat it. I mean, we hope it will become part of the expectations of our program. Um, and then, yeah, winning that first game, and then let's just see what happens tomorrow. <laughs> Take it one day at a time. Uh, but we're really loving it. Perfect.